Hello, and thank you to ACSE for inviting me to share my thoughts and ideas. Today, I want to explore how artificial intelligence, when used thoughtfully and ethically, is starting to reshape the peer review process, not by replacing reviewers, but by supporting them. Peer reviewers are the unsung heroes of scholarly publishing, yet in recent years, they've faced an overwhelming surge in submissions, tighter turnaround times, and growing expectations for depth, fairness, and transparency. That's especially challenging for early career researchers and for those whom English isn't a first language. What if peer reviewers had a secure, intelligent workplace, a kind of AI-powered assistant built to lighten their load and improve the quality of the review? That's the future we're starting to build. Let's be honest, peer review is demanding. Most reviewers fit it in after hours between lab work, teaching, and grant writing. They're expected to dissect complex manuscripts, check for novelty, evaluate methods, and offer constructive feedback, all without formal training or support. Early career reviewers, in particular, often face uncertainty. What should I comment on? How critical should I be? Am I missing something important? For researchers working in a second or third language, there's an added layer of challenge, clearly expressing nuanced critique, understanding unfamiliar phrasing, or feeling confident in their tone. That's where AI, if used responsibly, can provide real value, not as an evaluator, not as a ghostwriter, but as a confidential assistant that helps reviewers do their best work. So what does this kind of AI agent actually offer? Imagine a secure workspace where a reviewer uploads the manuscript they've been asked to evaluate. The system guides them through a structured review form tailored to the journal's criteria, originality, significance, methods, clarity. For each section, the AI can suggest draft text based on the manuscript's content the reviewer always has the option to revise, reject, or expand on these suggestions. The point isn't to write the review, but to help reviewers get started, stay focused, and avoid missing key areas. Second, the AI allows the reviewer to query the manuscript itself. Let's say a reviewer wants to understand the limitations of the study or needs clarification on a statistical method. They can highlight a passage and ask, what's the main finding here? Or is this methodology clearly explained? The AI provides an instant summary or explanation, freeing the reviewer to focus on judgment, not comprehension. Third, the assistant offers literature support. It can suggest relevant papers that aren't cited in the manuscript, flag excessive citation, or help assess whether a study makes a novel contribution. For reviewers who don't have institutional access to full databases, this kind of contextual help is invaluable. And for those still developing their reviewer voice, especially early career researchers, there's a language assistant. It can take bullet points and turn them into clear professional feedback. It flags overly harsh language and helps strike a constructive tone while leaving full control to the human reviewer. Finally, there's a review activity dashboard. It quietly tracks how much time the reviewer spends per section, how often they ask the AI for help, and how much of the final report is AI suggested versus reviewer written. This data is never shared externally, but it can help journals recognize reviewer contributions or to train new reviewers. Of course, with AI, we can't ignore the risks. That's why a trustworthy system uses private publisher-approved environments, never public chatbots. No manuscript data is used to train the AI. Nothing is stored after the review, and every AI action is logged so the reviewer and the journal can see exactly what was generated and when. This keeps the process transparent auditable, and secure. The AI isn't making decisions. It's offering suggestions 
prompts, summaries, and reminders. The reviewer stays in control always. That's the key to preserve both the integrity of the process and the dignity of the reviewer's role. As we look ahead, it's clear that peer review is evolving. The burden is real and growing. But with the right tools, we can support reviewers without compromising standards. We can make peer review faster, more thoughtful, and more accessible, especially for the next generation of researchers and those working across languages and disciplines. AI won't replace peer reviewers, but it can help them do their job better. And in time, when trusted science is more important than ever, that kind of help is not just welcome, it's essential. Thank you.